We are just 17 days away from the Super Bowl, and 12 News is your Super Bowl coverage headquarters. The Super Bowl is about so much more than one game. It's a real community event. Team 12's Kariba Devine shows us one event ahead of the big game where kids were helping kids. Kariba? Yeah, that's right, Tram, and you said it. When the Super Bowl comes to town, it's about more than just a football. There is a lot of engagement between the NFL and communities in our city. And today it was all about kids giving back to kids. Thousands of items were donated to students in need, and it was all done by students right here in the Valley. Now, it is called the NFL's Super Kids Super Sharing Project. And this morning, the donated items were delivered to the Salvation Army Center in Phoenix. Students filed into the gym to deliver and sort out all of the gently used books, school supplies, and items to give away. The drive was organized by the Super Bowl host committee and NFL Green, which sponsors drives like this ahead of the Super Bowl. We really just want to give these kids the experience and the feeling of how good it feels to really give back and help those in need. Now, the items were donated over the past few weeks by more than 70 schools and youth organizations. More than 100 schools and organizations have signed up students who actually received those items this afternoon. And a check for $25,000 was also presented to Chicanos por la Causa to help families going through hard times. And the Super Bowl is, of course, a big business opportunity. The city of Glendale just announced a new interactive map that hopes to help visitors find local places where they can shop and eat. There are businesses across 12 categories posted on the map. QR codes leading to the map will be posted on signs and flyers around the city of Glendale. And the hope is, is that Glendale will see a large economic boom thanks to the Super Bowl coming to town. And then coming up tonight on 12 News at 6 and at 10 o'clock, uh, hotels. As you can imagine, they're already almost all booked for the Super Bowl. We're going to tell you about where some of the vacancies are and the insane prices that people are paying. And guys, just a little teaser. Can you imagine a room at Motel 6 going for almost $1,000? It is insane. A guys, Motel we'll 6? Well, yeah, they leave the lights on for you. <laughs> Wow. We have to pay that electricity. That electricity bill is high. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Rebe, thanks. Stay with 12 News, 12news.com, and the 12 News app every day through the Super Bowl for all you need to know about the concerts, parties, and much more.